Also, <laughs> before we get too out of line here, I just want to hit play really quick. Fuck! Oh! Coming soon it's to the theaters. VHS trailer game live it's, and in person. It's, it's, it's so weird. It's, it's, I have to watch myself be disenfranchised. Now, now listen, everybody. Eric, I... I, 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 I you Congratulations, know, I, I, Chris. Is this your no, victory no, speech? No, 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 no. I just wanted, I let them know that, like, when you came, I, I, you had a lot of stipulations. Mm-hmm. You searched me. You searched my bag. <laughs> yeah, you got wanded hard. Yeah, you yep, got, it turned out you forgot your fucking buzzer, dude. I, I did. <laughs> I forgot my buzzer. Seas, which I, I think, think it's it, disqualified. It should be. The technicality it right it, there. It sounds a little drunk. drunk. Yeah. Why don't it, you put the speaker towards the microphone, speaking of drunk? Oh, this. Yeah. There you go. We, we, we did have, full disclosure, we had a few beers before this together. Oh, uh-huh. yeah. I was smoking weed in Central Park <laughs> earlier. <laughs> sure. So I'm just letting you know I got this handicap. Uh, <laughs> yes. Oh, wow. Wait, oh, my God. You, you smoked weed before a podcast for the first time? <laughs> Strange. That's going to be wild. <laughs> Well, this is this is kind of the first time. I usually save it for after. Oh, Drunk okay. while we're recording. Jesus <laughs> oh, Christ, that's, my man. That's, that's normal. <laughs> now, all right. So, Chris Cabin, yes. your your buzzer sounds like an eighty five year old man farting. Yes. Let's do that. Do you again. want me to get it? Yeah. There you go. Now, Eric Siska. Oh, and there now, you go. And now me. All right. So then, no. this is the VHS trailer game, as you all know. Mm-hmm. Uh, America's favorite game about arcane materials. Yeah, so the way it works is I'm going to ask, I'm going to give five clues each round. Yeah. Um, once someone guesses in that round, they are out and they cannot guess again until uh, until the next round. I always do uh, a big, this big spiel and everybody gets out on the first clue anyway. Nobody gives a shit. Mm. But I will say we're getting close here. And this is the final where it's what? May. It's May at, in August. We're going to do the final VHS trailer game. And then the winner will be crowned in September. Yeah, congrats, Unbelievable. Chris. Yeah. So are we going to do, so like the start of season 12 is when we'll crown the winner? Yes. And I think probably between that, because we'll have a little level we'll of, of a layoff, whomever wins. Wait, will, what? Am I getting fired? Um, oh, we're going to have a whole, Oh, man, I can't believe you told him on the air. That's <laughs> fucked up. Uh, <laughs> the, uh, <clears throat> Eric, mm, uh, the uh, podcast didn't uh, perform quite as well as we wanted last quarter, so... Um, <laughs> Hi, this is uncomfortable. Uh, mm, mm. Boy, this happens a lot. Um, <laughs> if there's any other movie podcast, reach out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, but so, uh, yeah, but I think in August, I think in September, I'd like to come back with the cameo ready to go as yes, the crown sure. the winner. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Because uh, that's the prize that you get to use the WHM slush fund uh, to get your own cameo. I'm talking too long. Too long. Because we're in, in studio and it's kind it's, it's kind weird. of weird. Yeah. It is weird mm-hmm. talking to you three. Mm-hmm. Like a, uh, that's why I wanted to just hang outside. I you know, folks at home, not to give away too much about my location. I have a little like outdoor Ooh. terrace. We were drinking some beers, hanging out. I wanted to just hang because I don't know how to talk to anybody that's not Chelsea. <laughs> no, <Nope>. it's very, <laughs> very weird. And I just wish I brought like some batons and bear mace. <laughs> so we're in what? person. <laughs> Can you stop the steal? Oh, okay. Sure. That's this steal thing. Okay. Yes. Okay. So three three rounds this time around. Uh, just okay. an FYI, one of these is a previous episode. Oh, oh. shit! Previous now, quick episode. question though: Is it the first one? <laughs> did you uh, did you get shafted by the VHS tape, or were there actual trailers on the tape? This is not YouTube material. Excellent question. I got. Two of these from the VHS tape, and I got one from a uh, VHS reel on YouTube, which is called like a de- from a demo tape, which I guess went to critics or whatever, because like that huh. had like all sorts of crazy shit, like the gun in Betty Lou's handbag. Wow! This movie, uh, uh, Serafina, if you remember that kind of that would be oh, yeah, Goldberg be movie. Yeah, oh yeah. shit! Wow, and great. all this stuff, I was like, none of this is gonna play in this room. But I got <laughs> one, so two, and then one. All right, I mean, all one right. of these are, is a previous episode. Hmm. Game Master's Clue, mm-hmm. a cross-country animal adventure. One might even call it an incredible... Oh, that's, I, I got Chris Cabin. Larger than life. Incorrect. Oh, I, oh no. Did you have it before yeah, me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I, sure? No, yeah, no, no, no. I, I, I heard, no, 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 no. I gotta, I gotta go back to the tape. It's tough. Um, uh, you know what? I'm going to do it for the first time ever because it's oh, in studio. Huh? We're going to do a coin flip. What? Oh, a coin oh, wow. flip. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, Eric, the, you can the, call it. Yeah, the view uh, heads. Uh, it is tails. Of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm showing people. No, no, it's tails. A rigged quarter. <laughs> yeah. uh, Andrew, that. do you know what it is? Uh, born to be wild. Incorrect. Oh, Son of a bitch bastard. Oh, 
Homeward Bound. That is five oh, big yeah. points. Oh, motherfuckers. Ziska. Now we're talking. <laughs> yeah. uh, yeah. the, the trivia uh, was that this was one of Don Amici's final movies before his death, the year of the film's release. That's oh, yeah. right, because when they made uh, uh, Homeward Bound 2, Lost in San Francisco... Dude, doing a Don Michi impression. Oh, wow. oh really? Yeah, which Did is just like an old man. Don, sound. And Don Michi was very old because he aged in dog years. <laughs> oh, yes, it's true. Yeah. yeah. Why didn't you just get Brian Dennehy at that point? <laughs> I don't know, because there's like a gentle sign to Don Amici that Brian Dennehy, I yeah. mean, beautiful man, of course, but portrayals on the screen, a lot of gruff stuff. Oh, come yeah, on. That, that, would, dog, that dog was a stone cold killer. <laughs> Brian Dennehy would voice like a garbage truck or something. Yes. It'd be awesome. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to smush this dresser. <laughs> Brian Dennehy. Give me your garbage. <laughs> Cut crunch. <laughs> Uh, Game Master's Clue, round two. Here we go. Uh, All right. Um, a faithful yet irreverent adaptation of a classic Victorian story led by a WHM favorite. A faithful yet irreverent adaptation of a classic Victorian story led by a WHM favorite. Ooh, wow. Fuck. You know, we always guess on the first thing. Maybe we should force this game master to <laughs> give us another clue. Oh, it's, it's we now. Okay. Oh, we're all it's working funny. against the game. Oh, now, that I'm a big, okay. now that I'm a high roller. Okay, <laughs> okay good. Fucking hard eight over here, man. <laughs> <laughs> Philip Baker Hall is going to tell you how to beat the trailer game. All right, so a say WHM favorite. All right, so this, this is the last time I'm going to say it, and then I will move on. Okay, all right. we're not, fair we're, enough. Uh, a faithful yet irreverent adaptation of a Victorian classic story Led by a WHM favorite. Led is the problem. Mm -hmm. uh, Starring. Uh, okay, no, I know. So you're backtracking your clue. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, I don't, know, I don't know if led means like, I, I don't know, like led. Now that I'm thinking about it, it sounds can, a little weird. Can I ask as a favorite, like we all like him or it, he's or they have appeared. We're making fun of this person a lot. They have appeared on this show quite a bit. Okay. I see. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I feel I feel like people at home right now are screaming in their cars, yeah. showers, uh, convenience stores that they're working at. They're garbage screaming trucks. for the for the VHS trailer game to be over. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, of uh -huh. uh, where, where's the fucking show? They scream. Okay. Uh, <laughs> tr Tribune trivia. Now we're down to four points. Cool. This movie was originally planned to be a television special. <laughs> All right. Okay. TV. Well, almost was well, supposed to be TV. Victorian. Irreverent. Irreverent. Yeah. WHM also, favorite. Do you got a it's dictionary, a Andy? It's also a faithful adaptation as well. Uh-huh. Victorian. Yeah. Yeah. An old Victorian London town. London town. Mm. That's, 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 that's what that's Victorian what means. <laughs> well, that's Victorian in New England. That's true. Well, that's, that's true. Well, I'm thinking about the house. When you say Victorian, I start thinking of Lovecraft. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. No, yeah. So uh, there, there uh, you go. You just beat another clue out of me, Eric. It's also <laughs> in England. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. <laughs> that's it. We're moving on. I got nothing. We're moving yeah. on to tagline, which is hilarious because there is no tagline on IMDb. But I will say the movie title itself is kind of, they didn't need a tagline for the poster because the movie title was basically the tagline. You know what I mean? You saw this title. Oh, it's that. I'm going to go see. I know exactly That's what that is. That's a great thing. clue. I'm just going to guess because yeah. I can't take this. Uh, the importance of being earnest. It is incorrect. Mm. Now here, uh, Eric and Andrew, get your buzzers ready for two big points because. Yeah, sit second, down, Chris. The uh. second star, Frank Oz. <laughs> what the fuck? Yoda's in this shit? Uh -huh. People are losing it right now. Yeah, uh, Muppet Christmas Carol. There he goes. Two oh. points. Oh. I said at the top, one of them was a previous app. You know what? The, yeah. mu the Muppets. Yes. Yes. Frank Oz uh, is a Muppet man. Mm -hmm. I, and I totally forgot. I wasn't thinking in terms of WLM. Oh, is okay. The That's interesting. But at the same time in my head, I was like, oh, well, you know, Victorian Michael Caine. I just didn't do it. Also, I'm on my fourth beer of the, of the <laughs> sure. afternoon. All right, sure, sure. Yeah, make all of the excuses yeah. you want. Okay. <laughs> Final round. Mm. Okay. Game Master's Clue. Okay. A family comedy that simultaneously cashes in on the popularity of Home Alone and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Mm. Family uh, comedy, geez. Home Alone mixed with Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. 
Hmm. Ah. Is it a little like? I don't know. I can't ask questions, right? Um, no, but what, it just just talk. Is it a little through. vulgar for a uh, family comedy? No, slightly? it's not. It's actually not. I think. Okay. I think it's. I think it's. It's squarely a kids movie. But like a gross kids movie potentially. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, what, what what are you thinking about? <laughs> I don't know. I got a I got a movie in my what head. About kids, it, Larry Clark's kids. <laughs> no, this is no, not no. a um. This is not a previous episode though. This is not a previous episode. We're now in squarely. I will say another clue just for the gentleman in this room. It's an episode we always kind of circle. Oh, should we do it? Should we not do it? Blah blah blah. blah. It's definitely going to be an episode someday. So Ninja Turtle. So like slimy men and a little boy that's trying to. <laughs> It's just save his house. I, all I can say is it cashes in on Home Alone. And the poster that I looked at today, but I'm not making this up, says it's home. It literally said, like, some critic is like, it's Home Alone meets Ninja Turtles. Oh, so, wow. So it's like what that. The fuck. Okay. We're going around uh, four here. Sure. Uh-huh. Um, tribute trivia. This is going to help anyone, I don't think. Uh, when Disney acquired the rights, the distribution rights to the film, the studio found it too violent. The filmmakers responded by adding cartoon sound effects to lessen the violence. The American version of the film also cuts out numerous parts of scenes, most likely to secure a PG rating. That I feel like is really weird to me, but. uh, Ooh, okay. Ah, Disney. Disney, someone getting kicked in the nuts. You hear a boy yoing sound kind of a thing. (laughs) Fuck my face. All right. All right. So tagline down to three points. Uh, There's three because they're all, none of them actually help. Action at its best. No. This one is has to be an IMDb misfuck up. Um, Disney's new or a big shot, a Bruce Lee for young people. And then coming at you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So it's 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 clearly like a Disney or like a Buena Vista yeah. touchstone pictures exactly. property. Uh-huh. <sighs> Ninja Turtles and Home Alone. Mm -hmm. All right. Star number two. This isn't going to help, but I'm also adding the character name just to talk it through because both of these people are a little bit uh, esoteric. Star number two is Michael Trainer as Rocky. Rocky as a character. And then this is one of the Ninja Turtle people. Yeah, most. Yes, most definitely. Now, you see, I think you guys are thinking about Ninja Turtle in the wrong way. I'm going to say that right now as we go into the final one. People in suits doing like puppet animatron. Shit? Yeah, I think you're thinking about it the wrong way. Is that the wrong way? That is the wrong way. Oh, okay. So it's slime men. I had that. No, right. it's a, d- d- like d- a d- group of fun loving so and so's. Yeah. Well, Fuck yeah. you if you get this. Yeah. Three ninjas. It is three ninjas wow. for Chris Cabin. You cannot what? keep this guy out of the out of the winner's bracket. <sighs> Man, Although Eric's my thought was going to be Little Monsters. Do you remember that movie with yes, Fred I do. Savage? Yeah. Oh yes. And totally. Howie Mandel is like a monster man. Yeah, three That's ninjas. right. Yeah, it, it, literally the poster is like, yeah, Home Alone because you know they, they get home invaded and they ninja around. They once but you but wavered not, off from the turtle shit. I was like, yeah. oh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, turtles okay. is a little misleading in terms of like you imagine there to be like warriors of virtue, disgusting pig monsters. Yes. That's why yeah. I yeah. asked yeah. if it was a previous episode yes. because I was thinking of warriors <laughs> yes. of virtue. I, I almost said, uh, what's that awful Ed Begley Jr. movie, Meet the Apple Game? Oh, oh yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never Horrible heard of this. What, meet oh. the Apple Girls. We they're had like, a, they're we, like alien ants yeah. underneath the skin. But that's oh. like a mon- that's like a horror movie kind of, right? No, or, it's uh, supposed to be like oh, a is kids it really? movie. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, like in the way that like Mac and me is a kids movie. <laughs> <laughs> sort of. <laughs> so we, we do, right? So is that it? That is it. That's where we're at. We did it. That's it. Uh, Eric Sisko picks up seven big points. Chris well, Gavin gets you know what? Two. Now, now that we're in the studio, Three, I think you're all getting a little intimidated. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. It's, it's absolutely you know, it's true. funny how the conspiracy just evaporates like that. It's <laughs> no, interesting, I mean, I it's think interesting maybe, how that it, happens. Like now that, that you're pointing very, this out, yep, I'm nope, thinking I'm you're very, taking a fall yep. in order to, <laughs> uh-huh. to okay. prop up some type of false narrative. <laughs> sure. Here. This is a good excuse I'm hearing. <laughs> From you. From, well, I didn't hey, say man, that might be okay. Only, how many points did you get today? Two. Yeah, that's what I thought. You got seven. <laughs> What is wrong with you? Still, where where are, still, you? are you? Are you off on the planet? You're still points. You're uh-huh. still okay. points. Yeah, okay. The folks at home want us to talk about the Mighty Ducks. 